The normal distribution can be used to approximate the binomial distribution. And this approximation works best if the sample size n is large and if the binomial distribution is symmetrical, that is when your success probability is close to 0.5. We usually say that the value of n is sufficiently large if n p and n 1 minus p are both greater than 5. So you will remember that if x follows the binomial distribution with parameters n and p, then the expected value of x is np and the variance of x is np1 minus p. So from this we can now say that if x follows the binomial distribution with parameters n and p, then the distribution of x can be approximated by the normal distribution with mean np and variance np. 1 minus p. Now consider the binomial random variable x with parameters n and p. An estimator for the population proportion of successes that we indicate with p is the sample proportion p hat and that is just the number of successes in the sample divided by the sample size. So p hat is equal to x over n. Now, because the distribution of x can be approximated by the normal distribution, the sampling distribution of the statistic p hat is also approximately normal. So we can now say that if x follows the binomial distribution with parameters n and p, then the sampling distribution of p hat, the number of successes in the sample over the sample size, is approximately normal with a mean of p and a variance of p 1 minus p over n.